Okay, so I put uh, four of those little divots all the way around. Um, so basically like, you know, 12 o'clock, three o'clock, six o'clock, nine o'clock. So I have four of those all the way around. And uh, as you can see that, that ridge that I was talking about before, that is a clip. So that's like an inner clip that uh, stays on the bear on the uh, shaft. Um, then the bearing rides right there. So, so that should work out pretty good. Um, I got the bearing cover off, as I said before. Um, I'm going to clean that bearing out now, and I'm going to repack it, and then I'm going to put the cover back on. Uh, of course, clean the cover real good too before you put it back on. Um, I'm also going to pop the jack shaft cover off. There's my 1.5 shim. Um, you don't have to worry about this clip here at all. That can stay in place, but you should be able to pop. I, I'm pretty sure I can pop this uh, cap off, no problem. Used to do it on my Apex. I don't see why not. And uh, now this bearing usually looks pretty good because it's not down, you know, down in the snow. So it doesn't usually get as rusty. So you don't have to do this one as often. Um, although this gets a lot more heat on this one. So it's so easy to pop it off and at least look at it and uh, throw a little fresh grease in there. It's, uh, it's a good thing to do for maintenance. Okay.